The Barnard Toddler Center has been welcoming toddlers to the Barnard campus for nearly 50 years. The Toddler Center is a vibrant, joyful place. The toddlers play and parents are supported. Our college students are learning about early development and we're doing research on this unbelievably important age. Because of COVID-19, we had to close. We immediately said, how can we connect to the children even though we can't see them right now? And that is what this whole virtual program has been based on, connection and relationships when you can't be together. It's so good to see everyone again at computer school. Hi. We say hello to Luke, how are you? Choo, choo. And we say hello to Rusty, and we say hello to Lenny, and we say hello to Saria, how are you? Choo, choo. It was definitely really interesting for us to see how two-year-olds responded to being on a Zoom call, which is really made for adults and business meetings. You can go back to gallery view, and then you can see everyone. So each class, meets right now as a virtual class every week. This says to them, this piece of your life that you had before is still here, and you can still see the children in your class, you can still see your teachers, and you're gonna be okay, because nothing matters more to a young child than that they have routines and a rhythm to their day and what they consider normalcy, even if it's the new normal. So we tried to bring everything from the classroom onto the computer. So we had the same good morning song. We did snack in the same way. We also did some art activities that were similar to what we did in the classroom. We sang all of the same movement songs and we always ended the day with the exact same goodbye song. In addition to the virtual sessions, we're making videos each week that we sent home to the children as another way to connect to them. Here we are at Barnard at the Toddler Center. This is school. The baby dolls, taking a little nap. The trucks, and there's the fish. Everything's here, just waiting. You know, it's not your fault that school's closed right now and all of the mommies and the daddies and the children are at home with their families. We created a video which um, was about hand washing and we also created a video about the teachers wearing their masks. And it's going to cover my nose and my mouth, but guess what? It's still me. <gasps> I think that the videos helped the children to see that their teachers and people that they trusted were doing the same thing as them and it just made it less scary for them. On some days, the children have come to computer school feeling really sad or frustrated, and we've been really grateful that we could still help them through those emotions and help their families through that, through the computer. I cry too sometimes, and mommies and daddies still love you even if you're crying and you're sad. If you're sad and you know it, you can cry, boo hoo. If you're sad and you know it, you can cry, boo-hoo. If you're sad and you know it, and you really want to show it, if you're sad and you know it, you can cry, boo-hoo. What we're learning every week is about the resilience of children, that as new routines set in, as parents show kindness and compassion, the children are actually okay. Even now, at the end of the year, we're having to say goodbye through the computer. So we're definitely looking forward to having a reunion of sorts when it's safe to do so. And we just can't wait to see all of the children in person. Bye everyone.